guys. So today I'm going to be talking about these um, these wool dryer balls. I don't know if you've ever heard of them or tried them, but um, these are actually supposed to um, help keep the your clothes soft in the dryer, help even take down the dryer drying time. Um, almost like an alternative to using dryer sheets, fabric softener, things like that. Um, they say that dryer sheets and fabric softeners aren't really great for the machine. Um, I'm a huge fabric softener user and I'm trying to get away from that. I've just started to notice that, um, you know, I do the two rinses for the fabric softener and the washing machine, but you just sort of sometimes feel like that film on the clothes and things like that. So um, I have been watching these wool dryer balls for a while and I finally pulled the trigger um, I saw a deal for them and they were a really good price. So we got six of them. Um, they are uh, firm, you know, like a tennis ball firm. And, um, but you know, you can st still kind of squeeze them anyway. Um, they're supposed to last, I mean, some people have had them for five or six years and they're still going strong, which is another huge plus to getting rid of dryer sheets or getting rid of fabric softener because you um you know you pop for your ten to twelve dollars for the one time and you can easily have them for years. Um, so they came in this plastic bag here and there's a little card with them. Um, the card says here um, they're smart smart sheep wool dryer balls and it just really quick says how do smart sheep dryer balls work? Um, they work by bouncing around in your dryer, lifting and separating clothing and increasing hot airflow. They cut down drying time, which saves you money and energy costs. Why are they better than fabric sheets? Fabric sheets use harsh chemicals to soften clothing, which are toxic to the environment, and the wool dryer balls are a nature-friendly alternative. Um, so they're 100%, uh, this one is 100% New Zealand wool. Um, it gives you instructions here too. Uh, you know, you place the, ball, the wool dryer balls in there, and then um, you turn on the dryer, and it says watch your clothes dry faster and stuff. Um, it gives you instructions like use three to four for a smaller medium load, five to six for larger loads. I almost always do large loads. There's a lot of us, there's a lot of clothes, so I almost <coughs> always do large loads. So I used all six for the loads. Um, and I wanted to use them for the first time and see what I thought before doing a video. So last night I did a load of towels and no fabric softener or anything, just my um, laundry detergent pods and I did two rinses and then um, I threw this the laundry in with the six balls um, and I was reading on all the reviews and stuff like that and they had mentioned that you could use if you like um, maybe a little bit of fragrance so one of my biggest things I like about laundry or fabric softener besides the fact that it makes the clothes a little bit softer is that the smell that is on there I just I kind of like that extra scent um, obviously clothes just smell good clean but I like kind of that extra scent that it gives it so um, people were saying that you could put essential oils on the, the balls themselves and you would get kind of an extra scent in the um, dryer so I have this premium essential oil collection that I got off of Amazon I got the smart these um, smart sheep wool dryer balls off Amazon as well um, and it just has six different um, essential oils in it eucalyptus lavender orange lemongrass peppermint and tea tree oil um, I went ahead and took three of these and I took the lavender and I just kind of dotted all over in random places on the, the ball not too much you know, maybe like five dots is the most on three of these the other three I didn't do anything to and um, it so after um, they were all washed and dried, I had set the dryer maybe about 15 minutes less than what I would normally do on a time dry. And all of the towels were dry and they were not staticky at all. They were soft. Um, they still had like that towel softness, but at the same time, they um, had, had that firmness of a towel that you know it's gonna dry you off. Um, a huge difference from with my fabric softener, I feel like it, it kind of was like, there's a different feeling, maybe a filmy feeling, I'm not sure, but I really was impressed with this. And then when I smell them, I get that light lavender scent, so it's not overbearing, so I think doing just the three was a good idea, but it's a nice smell um, that I really enjoyed. So I was really happy with what um, the essential oils did. Now the one thing to keep in mind that if you do decide to use essential oils on um, the wool dryer balls, they're only going to last about two to three 
loads and then you're going to have to reapply the oil to it because um, it'll wear off and uh, I mean I only did one and I mean we you could smell still smell the oil on it pretty strong so I think that once I start to not really smell it I will go ahead and refresh um, another thing too is that when I was reading up so tea tree oil is something that is great um, for a lot of different reasons but one of the biggest reasons that um, a lot of people talk about tea tree oil is for lice purposes now obviously if you don't have kids in school or have to worry about lice then you know maybe this isn't a big plus for you but for me um, we knock on wood have not had any lice issues thank goodness but um, we do always get those notes every so often from the school saying that there has been some so um, I have some spray that I put in the girls hair like conditioning spray just so that and even the boys and stuff just to help you know so that nothing happens but tea tree oil is something good that they say that you can even put in the hair and we have tea tree oil in our shampoo so some people are saying um, that they put a few drops of tea tree oil in the washing machine now tea tree oil to me smells good already so um, I haven't done it with the towels but I'm going to with our laundry start just putting maybe like two maybe three drops in there because I do do a large load of tea tree oil just in the washing machine and wash it with our um, our laundry detergent just to kind of another thing you know to boost the clothes and and, uh, and such but um, so yeah that is basically it um, I I'm really glad that I went ahead and finally purchased these um, I some of the reviews that I was reading said that they they've had theirs for like five years and um, I mean that's huge because I'm buying fabric softener I don't know you know um, maybe twice a month and so that cuts that cost and then so you pop for you know 12 to 15 dollars for your first purchase and you don't have to make that purchase again for another three to five years I mean that makes a big difference as well um, I really wasn't uh, doing this for the you know cutting down on the dryer time I wasn't worried about that but it didn't it did definitely um, when I said it 15 minutes less they were already dry um, and as far as a noise factor so um, a lot of people are asking about a noise noise on the reviews that I was reading so you will hear something a little bit extra um, that is in there but it's not loud it's not like putting a shoe in there and it's like banging all over the place um, so I I left the laundry room and I didn't hear it anymore just while I was in the laundry room, I could hear just that kind of little extra something was kind of hitting against the side. But once I left the laundry room, I didn't hear anything and it was good to go. So um, if you are looking for something um, to help soften your clothes, maybe you are looking to get rid of dryer sheets, maybe you're looking to get rid of fabric softener like I was, I really recommend trying the wool dryer balls. Um, I was really pleased with my first load. Um, so yeah, I that's that's um all i really have it's it's you know it did make a difference for us so um again as always guys thanks for watching and putting up with with our videos that are all over the place whether it's a review on something or just us having fun um and you know just keep watching subscribe and thank you again have a good day bye